Hey guys, this is all streamed out. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another episode of PGA 2K23 with our My Career. And uh, we finally beat Lydia Ko last time and now our rival is Tiger Woods. Our sponsors are Adidas and Callaway. And we are over 4,000 behind Lydia Ko in the FedEx Cup standings, but we are in fourth. We are in the, I think it's the last three tournaments of the year. Um, we've got the FedEx St. Jude Championship at TPC Southland. Let's get into today's tournament. And our first hole is a par four. FedEx St. Jude Championship is about to begin. I'm Luke Elvey, alongside Major Champion Rich Beeman. Go a little bit fast. That's fine. We are still in the fairway. Hi, Luke. I'm very happy to be out here. If this event kicks off, our feature group consists of two players. Let's go right about there. To have entered into this fantastic mm. rivalry. Well, Henny, quite a not quite what I wanted. For themselves, we've seen them beat many of their rivals this season. But there are not many people that can go up against the great Tiger Woods. Okay, we're gonna get a par then. Oh, well, they certainly do not lack in confidence. I'm happy enough with that to start with. Uh, we're even with Tiger. Oh, I'm jumping around in my seat, and I can also see Rich Beam doing exactly the same. He managed this feat back in 2002 when he won the PGA at Hazeltine. There we go. Oh, please, Luke, don't mention that. Once we get Rich on his high horse, there's no getting him down again. Although he has shown that it can be done, Tiger Woods can be beaten. However, it is such a tall order. I know that this not bad. All of these incredible roster of players and all these rivalries so far, but come on, this is Tiger Woods. Can it really be done today? Well, that's the oh, we should have had that. Very few people have ever laid claim to beating Tiger head to head. Good luck in your ride. Okay, we get another par. Why don't we catch up with our man in the hot seat, Tiger Woods? It's been neck and neck. He's actually tied with his rival. This is tough. Can he do it? Of course. Well, that'll help you move up the leaderboard. Yeah, that is not what you want to come up against mid-round, mid-round. So we are one behind Tiger. The third hole at TPC South wins a strong par five, measuring over 550 yards from the back tees. A bit of water comes into play here on the second shot. That was perfect, and ooh. Can we clear that tree? Playing this shot from around 220 yards here. Looks like they've got the five wood. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Feel the leaves going through there. And here we are with the third shot. Yeah, give yourself a pat on the back. This putt is about eight feet. Little birdie look in here. We got it. So far. Okay. It's a lovely putt to make for birdie. Take some pride in that one. He finds himself in a share of 10th place. Caught up to Tiger. I like it. The fourth hole here at TPC Southwind is the first par three on the course, and it measures just under 200 yards. Just avoid the penalty area to the left. That could have been better. Birdie at the last. This for another. A chance now from the bunker for an up and down. Okay, that, that was for par. Let's get back to it, shall we? Oh, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. All right, this to get ahead of Tiger Woods. What a sentence, what a one-up that would be, and what a rivalry this is. Right about there. Now short. Didn't quite have the right stuff there. A little too cautious on that. That's fine. We're still tied with Tiger. That's all we need to do. The fifth at TPC Southwind is a long path. Just keep up with him and then hope that he will make a mistake. A good, drive We've got a par four. And then an accurate approach into this green. Wonderfully played. This shot coming from around 220 yards. 
Four shots behind our leader. They've chosen to club down here. Okay, not terrible. One's on the dance floor. You can two putt that for sure. Now heading over to Tiger Woods. He's trying to pull ahead in this group rivalry. Let's see what happens. Okay, so we need to make this to keep up with them. And now this is what can happen when you start up a rivalry with a player of this caliber. Now pulling further ahead of his playing partner. What a shot to make. This has Got it. Yes. Good putt. And with it, he'll move to a couple under par. Well, I think that warrants another look. Let's see that again. Now this, this is how you putt. Take another look at this. Amazing. Even the initial lineup, I didn't do too bad. I just had to move it just a little tiny bit. Finds that player moving up the leaderboard after that hole. The strategy at the sixth here at TPC Southwind on this par four, measuring just under 450 yards from the tip, is to position. Okay, well that was perfect. Rich, we saw it right throughout Tiger Woods' career, just epic shot after epic shot. What was the best shot you ever saw Tiger hit? We were playing in 2002 in the Grand Slam of Golf uh, over in Hawaii. Uh, Justin Leonard, Davis Love, Tiger, and myself. And we, on the second day, wind's blowing at a pretty good clip on the par five. I think it was number seven. And you had to bust two shots to get there. Nobody. Wow. It was nearly impossible. And in fact, it was impossible with three out of the four of us to get it home in two. Well, Tiger gets up there on the okay. par five the second day. He's already leading by like eight. We're still tied. And he drills one right down the middle. I lay up with a three wood. That's how hard it's blowing. I lay up with a three wood to about 70, 80 yards. And this little green is a little peninsula. It kind of goes from left to right. We're in the fairway. Of a fade, if you're a right handed player, with water on the front part of the green and the pins in the, in the back right. And he gets up there and smokes driver off the deck into about a 25 mile an hour wind to about six feet away. And I look over at my caddy and I go, is this for real? I mean, are you sure that we're not in a video game right now? Because that's just not possible. I mean, it literally, the second shot off the deck with the driver was hit about four head high. Close. About 70 into the wind. And the ball just kind of hung there. Seemingly just about 20 feet off the ground, just hung there. And kept hanging, kept hanging, kept hanging, and fell right exactly where he wanted it to. It, it was, it was unbelievable and at that moment in time you kind of sit there and look at at yourself on the inside okay so he must depart then too i don't have that shot and i don't even know how to make up for a shot like and that he that did through seven we are tied they're watching watching something that nobody else in the game can do it, it's phenomenal looks to have opted for the eight iron uh, that's going right this would be a momentum saver here, getting this up and down. That's fine. Ooh, that almost went down. Uh, that's a touch of class. Terrific little chip. Yes. Okay. Very smooth tempo. And Tiger did the same. Our leader <clears throat> is a couple of shots up at this stage. The finishing hole on the front nine here at TPC Southwind plays downhill towards a dog leg right. There's a big body of water, the short front left of this green. That'll work. Got enough club to reach the surface. And what's in front of them there, Henny? Setting up here from about 140 yards. Looks like this is going to miss just right. Not sure if that's what's not quite what I wanted. Getting ready to play their third. Currently four shots off the pace. Oh, a lovely opportunity to save par here. Okay. That's a good putt to make, that one. <laughs> Why don't we catch up with what Tiger Woods is up to? It's been neck and neck. He's actually tied with his rival. It's a birdie. 
Can he do it? Hmm. Nice bunker shot, not rewarded, however, still very good. Patrick Cantlay's hit. So we should, yep, we are still tied at two under with Tiger. The 10th of TPC Southwind is a par four that plays just over 450 yards from the back tee. That was perfect, and... Mm. Accuracy on both shots are required. Wow. Okay, okay. Not easy to find the green coming out of the rough. Here's Tiger Woods. Oh, that one just missed the hole. So he's going to par. And here we are with the third shot. Four strokes off the lead. And so are we. Big power saver coming up for this fella. Okay. Yeah, well hold. Let's move on to the next. Through ten, we're still tied with Tiger. Finds himself one shot clear at the top of the leaderboard. The par three eleventh at TPC Southwind measures just 162 yards. But looks can be deceiving here. While it looks pretty, it can bite you. Make sure you've got enough club here on approach. Okay. What are we looking at for this part, Henny? Yeah, they've left it in the perfect spot here, just below the hole. They can be aggressive up the hill. We got it in two. Put some real pressure on their rival now. Okay. Currently at minus We're ahead of Tiger. Gotta like it, moving up the leaderboard, never a bad thing. The par 4 12th is only a short one measuring 406 yards from the tips. But you need to be very accurate off the tee. Avoid that huge... There we go. To the right, and I'll take the that. Into this green. Any drive that's pushed left will make it a difficult approach. And be wary, there's water over the back of this green, which you can't see. Clubbing up, smart. Got to control it, though. Let's see. Why don't we catch up with our man in the hot seat, Tiger Woods? He's got some work to do. Okay, this one's for Birdie. He's going to par. And back to the course with the live action. Lovely moment here. Good opportunity to move into a tie for third. Oh, what a great stroke. Gets that one to go. We are two ahead of Tiger. Gotta like it. Two in a row. He's feeling it. Trailing by a few shots. Okay, and we're three behind the leader. The 13th, the TPC Southwind, is a strong par four that plays uphill and a slight dog leg to the right. It requires a big drive up the right half. It's a good a drive. Approach. There's a heavily bunkered green there, so make sure you hit your approach in the right distance. Okay, we're going to go a little bit short. Playing alongside Tiger Woods. They almost got sort of, you know, spooked by the occasion. Why was that? More than anything else, it's the fact that they're playing in front of more people than they ever had in their life before and this rings true for i think every single player out there whether it was ernie ells bj singh right about there from that era you had more eyeballs on you at that moment than anybody else because wow the biggest crowds every single tournament and so sometimes it would be uncomfortable even for the most accomplished players out there some of them will tell you no it wasn't a big deal but i, I can promise you it got their attention and it probably helped them in a certain sense because when you played in front of that that's a good putt you wanted to focus you wanted to put your best foot forward because there is no worse feeling in the world than going out <clears> and laying an egg in front of 30,000 people i can promise you we're three ahead of tiger we're one behind the leader when you went out there you <clears> had to play well you didn't want to embarrass yourself we've got a par three 
the 14th at TPC Southwind is one of their signature holes. The par three that plays downhill considerably long, around 240 yards, is hit over a big body of water to the right. Fortune favours the brave here. If you need a birdie, go flag hunting. Otherwise, lay up to around 20 feet left. This one's for birdie. Not quite there. That's frustrating. And that should secure I'll take the par. Now heading over to Tiger Woods. Now, who'd have thought we'd see this? He is behind his rival. Can he do the catching up that's necessary? That is okay, he parred as well. What a shot. And look out, guys. This rivalry looks like it's going to get pretty. We're two difficult. behind the leader and three ahead of Tiger. On his playing partner. Accuracy is required at the par 4 15th, just 395 yards off the tee. Players like to lay back to give them their right number into this green. And there's a little creek that meanders through the center of the fairway here and up to the right side of the green. So make sure your approach is. Okay, that was perfect, and we are in the rough. That was a little untidy, wasn't it? Why don't we catch up with what Tiger Woods is up to? He's currently trailing his rival. Let's see what happens here. Great looking shot, this. Okay, he is. That's right <clears throat> He's gonna birdie. Exquisite. Oh, Henny, that looks like a putrid lie. Is it bad? This is like a bad lie with a bit of grilled bad lie on top, sprinkled with dashings of bad lie. I didn't see that outcome from that lie. That was great work. Now, this is a challenging one. A lengthy putt awaits. Their short game today has been absolutely sublime fun to watch. Right about there. Nope. Ouch, that hurts. Three feet to go here to the hole. This is what they have left for Okay, that's fine. And it's just We're still ahead of Tiger. The 16th at TPC Southwind is the last genuine birdie hole on the course. It's a par 5 measuring just 530 yards, but there's a lot required on the tee shot that's played uphill to a ridge. If you can get it up over the rise, a good chance for reaching the green here in two to set up a birdie and even perhaps eagle. But be wary of this green. There's a big bunker short left, and if you find it, it's not an easy up and down. Maybe even a par can be hard. Setting up to play the shot here from the green side rough. Okay, that's fine. So much easier when you roll like that, isn't it? Gotta say, his short game is phenomenal. Mark it down. That Good birdie. Today. And that will move him to six under par. And as we look at the leaderboard, this player is in second behind England's Justin Rose. And after that good play, moving up the leaderboard. The penultimate hole at TPC Southwind is a very strong par four, measuring 490 yards off the back tees. There is okay, that's going to be good. Of the fairway here, but that only catches the biggest of drives. There's two big trees either side that you want to position yourself in the middle of, so then you can hit a clean shot to the green. Two strong shots required to get onto the surface. Probably could have hit that full. Let's see if we can make this big putt for birdie. Nope, we're gonna par. So close. Putting for a par here. Why don't we catch up with our man in the hot seat, Tiger Woods? Now, who'd have thought we'd see this? He is behind his rival. Can he do the catching up that's necessary? Okay, and he's gonna par that one too. Going down. So after that effort, let's have a look at the contenders and the pretenders. The Englishman Justin Rose. Wow, we are up by four on Tiger. Nicely on top. Well, the finishing hole at TPC Southwind is an absolute beauty. There's been some heroic moments like hole out eagles, and there's been triple bogeys that have cost championships. Your job is to get the ball safely into the fairway here. And if you're not a long driver, don't take on the corner. But if you can, it'll leave you just a short iron. Works in. for me. Seal the victory with a birdie. Good shot there. And this putt is for birdie three on the scorecard. That's close.
get the fist pump ready. This looks like it's going in. Okay. And that'll be all she wrote today. Well played. Finished seven under on the first round. And as this round winds down, he finishes in a tie for the lead. Wow, okay. And Tigers four back. We're tied for the lead. Folks at 2K Sports, thanks for tuning in and see you next time. And we got a new driver, a new head. Okay. For the FedEx Cup. So this is the second round. Luke Elvey here with Rich Beam in the booth. And Rich, it's the final round in this one. What's our next player dealing with as they start their round? Well, they start off with a very small lead. And so they're going to be cognizant of that. Okay, that's fine. Room for error, but in saying that, they do have the lead. So they can't afford to make a mistake somewhere along the line if it should happen to come up. But in saying that, they just don't want to make any mistakes. It's going to be a difficult day all around. Can't wait to get into the action. Very excited. Got it. Today. Well, that's a nice way to start. Riding okay. Number down on the school card at the first. Can't birdie them all unless you birdie the first, Luke. Good start. Why not take another look at that effort? And after that fine display, they are holding first spot on the leaderboard with Lydia Ko trailing in second place. Wow, okay, so uh, we should know I'm pretty sure this will be before too long if we actually have a shot here. Nicely done. And Henny, what's he looking at here? And from about 105 yards. That'll work. This player showing zero signs of any nerves. We're killing it now. Their rival and playing partner, Tiger Woods. What a fantastic approach. This is buckets. Okay. Okay, time to return to the action. What an opportunity to make a birdie. Some momentum being built now. That's back-to-back -back birdies. Two in a row there, Luke. Get so Tiger is about six holes ahead of me. This hole is a par five. The third hole at TPC Southwind, Rich. The first of the par fives on the golf course. A lot of water in play. You need to be brave if you're going for this in two. More golf balls hit into the We water. should not have done it that way. Than any other golf course on tour. An excellent reason why you get a little careless. That water on the right hand side is going to gobble up that second shot. Be nice to see this one go down. Let's see if they make it. That's That'll work. Hold, this one. It's a birdie. That hole looks double the size for this player this week. And now that finds him in first place. Okay, Tigers slowly catching up. Now on the tee, fresh off a birdie, a great opportunity to build on that momentum. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. Nice. Oh, that's a good line. That should find the surface. John, give us a small update. Hey guys, we are checking in with Tiger Woods as he gets set for his next shot here on the tenth. Didn't that look good for a long time? Okay, let's get back to it, shall we? This putt just five feet away from the hole. I like the look of this. And with that, that's their fourth birdie. This guy is putting the lights out of it this week. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Let's see what Got a par four. Yeah, great rhythm on that swing. Great swing. Setting up here, coming off a run of birdies. It's a good start to the day. Let's hope they can keep up the good form. Feeling strong, going for less club. 
Oh, wonderful shot. And a chance for Birdie at the fifth. Luke, nothing gets past you. Yes, this kid is a stud. So far, so good. Another one. <clears throat> display this week with that wand. Leading by a shot after that hole. Let's see what happens here on the sixth. And we're going to stay in the fairway. That's tidy. And this shot from about 150 yards out. Currently in the lead by a shot. They're not a bad shot, that one. Could have been better. The hole if they want to make the birdie, though. Well, it's time to head back down to the fairways. John, what's up, mate? Hey, guys, we are checking in with Tiger Woods as he gets set for his next shot here on the 12th. Scorecard filled with threes never hurts. Good putt to make this. Oh, wow. What a putt. Well, that's worth reviewing. Let's roll the video tape. I could watch this one all day. That is amazing. Okay. Leader now has a one stroke advantage. Let's see what happens here on the seventh. Eight days a week that rhythm works. Could have been better. I won't be too bad in the first cut. Opting for the six iron. Might get caught up in the brush here. That kind of turned a little bit towards the hole. On the ground, John, he's down there. What's the news? Hey, guys, we are checking in with Tiger Woods as he gets set for his next shot here on the 13th. Ooh, almost wow, okay. Let's catch up with the current proceedings. 15 feet to the cup. It's another slow mover. Line. Geez, making this wow Keep surging ahead. seven for seven sitting at minus 14 now for the event two ahead of justin rose just a couple to play here on the opening nine here's the tee shot at the eighth okay with the nine iron i think okay tell you what They've got their rhythm going there. That's another green in reg. Another green in regulation. This is an absolute... There's game. another two. Or another... Yeah, they're good moments. Birdie. Because those ones... Good putt for birdie. And as we take a look at the standings, this player is currently in first. With Justin... Rose We're Smith. running away with it right now. Time to face a par four now. We're four ahead. Nicely done. Second shot here on the ninth. Going with the pitching wedge here. Mm, okay. This one looks like it's going right. John, what's going on? Talk to us, Goose. Hey guys, we are checking in with Tiger Woods as he gets set for his next shot here on the 15th. Almost. Getting ready to play their third. Oh, 
Okay, that's my first par. Well, this is where the knees start to knock the sweat starts. So we're through nine, and we are three ahead of Justin Rose in first. Yes, but if they start thinking about it, that's where the danger happens. They have to keep their head down and keep playing on the front foot if they want to see this thing home. Uh, it's heading to the rough for mine. Just a little bit, no problem. And Henny, what's he looking at here? He's got uh, about 140, I'd say. Choosing the 9 iron here. Come on, get a good bounce to the left. Decent roll. Oh, that was tricky with that wind. Great shot there. A putt here to move to 16 under par. What a great opportunity here for a look at a birdie. A little bit. You know, Luke Donald once made all 400 plus attempts inside the okay. PJ Tour. Let's head out to the 16th hole. Let's check in with Tiger Woods. Big time play that one at the right time too. Saving one there after being all over the parking lot, chipping in for the par. Our current leader is enjoying a two stroke lead. Oh. A little untidy, wasn't it? Straight into the water. And here we are with the third shot. Currently leading by two. Ooh, that almost went down. Putting now for a bogey. This one's looking good. Okay. Now leading by one shot. We're still a shot up, so that's that was our mistake. Now teeing off on the 12th hole. Do you attack it and try and increase your lead, or do you lay back and play safe? I like to attack it. What do they like to do? Handy effort, that one. Okay. John, do you have any info down there? Hey guys, we are checking in with Tiger Woods as he gets set for his next shot here on the 18th. Ow! And back to the play, shall we? Good look at a birdie here. Wow. And this one is for his par. Okay, I'll take a par. Well hold. We're still one up. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard after that effort. Here we have a long par four. It's gonna take two great shots to get on. There's the first one. Not bad. From around 170 yards here. Wind is going straight at his back. Yeah, that'll work. That's fine. And this putt to move to 15 under par. Good stuff today, especially the short game has been really Kay. good today. Okay, steady now. Five feet coming up to the cup. Well, that'll maintain the momentum. So where are we at now? With that hole complete, this tied. tied for top spot alongside Justin Rose. All right, getting into our final stretch. Time to tee off here at the 14th. Going with the five wood. Well struck. Well, this will be a big putt to make. The birdie always nice, but particularly when it's a two. There we go. That's a good putt to make. That sets the great players from the good ones. And after that hole, he's no longer sharing top spot. He's at the summit all alone. 
We have a par four on this one. I've seen worse looking swings at a playground. Oh. Right into the water on that one. Getting ready to play their third. He leads the field by a stroke. And choosing the eight iron here. No point hanging on to that one. You didn't hit your best there. What are we looking at for this putt, Henny? He's got to be careful this doesn't get away from him here. This is downhill. Yep. Oh, just missed. Yeah, it's just about three feet away. Too many mistakes. Now 13 under par, heading down the stretch. Inching their way closer to the top of that leaderboard. Can't afford any mistakes from here on in. Not too sure that one. Wow. Didn't even come close to resembling a golf swing. Well, Rich, I'm being honest. This lie is putrid. And he's down there. Setting up this shot with the wind in their face. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. Okay. We might be able to do this one. It sets up a chance for birdie. Now, this would be a good putt to make. Stay close to the leader. One of the good guys out there, Luke. I am hoping for this one to fall. What a putt. Started this perfectly. <coughs> That's inside the range. Currently 14 under for the event. Tied. Okay. See your name moving up the wow. Never a bad Got thing. a par four? This hole's a tough two shotter. A long par four. Beautiful swing there. That'll work. Time for the second shot at the 17th. Going with the seven. Now a little off the mark on that approach shot. And coming up well short. This would be a great up and down. What's in front of them, Henny, with this putt? He's looking at around 14 foot, I'd say. Solid little par putt here. That gets the okay. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. All right, Rich, you know the scenario. Tied for first place as we begin the final hole. Mm. Smell that, Luke? That smells like a playoff. Oh, no. And from the bunker here. Okay. Good shot there, Beamer. And this is why they put in hours and hours of practice. A putt to win it all. Just didn't drop. Well, this is it. They need this putt to force a playoff. Nice stroke. And there it is, Rich. We're going okay. to holes now. Well, Rich, it's time to find out who will win this in a sudden death playoff. Oh, and this tournament deserved it, Luke. So good all day long. This will be intense, Rich. So much pressure, and these players won't be stopping until one of them wins the hole. Buckle up. Luke, I'm ready. Let's go. Gotta say, just some of the best. That works for me. Well, it seems obvious. They really need to stick this one close if they want to have a chance. They have to expect their opponent to make that putt, Luke, so you have to take a chance and get it close. Mm. This green in a playoff. Hopefully they can regain their composure. And here we are with the third shot. Okay. 
We did not win. We couldn't hit the green in two. If we could hit the green in two, we would have had a good ch a good chance. But well, that's a shame, Rich. They toiled all tournament only to come unstuck when it mattered most. We beat Tiger though. Nope, always a tough pill to swallow losing in any way, but losing in a playoff, ooh, that stings. Well, thank you, sports fans. Hope you enjoyed all the coverage of our playoff finale. And from myself and all the dedicated people at 2K Sports, thanks for tuning in. Catch you next time. Okay. So for beating Tiger, we got a wedge head. We got a tailor made um, club. We got a Titleist putter and $150. Okay, so uh, all rivals have been defeated. Um, compete your way back through the rival tiers for more rewards. Okay. We will decline Ben Hogan. We will decline Ping. We will decline Nike. And we are still in fourth. So we are going to... Um, Let's go for Bubba Watson. Because Harold Varner is not going to be in this uh next in this next set, I don't think. He will not because there's only 70. Okay. So Bubba Watson will be our rival. Sponsors are Adidas and Callaway. We are uh, about thirty two hundred back from Lydia Co. We're catching up on Justin Rose. And the next one will be uh, the basically the semifinals, uh, the BMW Championship at Wilmington. But that will be the next episode. I want to thank everybody for watching. My name is Allstream. That hit the like button if you like this type of content. It lets me know that you like this particular type of content and would like to see more. Hit the subscribe button and ring the bell for notifications to be notified every time I post a video, and follow me on Twitter, Twitch, and Discord. The links will be in the description below. Have a wonderful day.